and welcome back to another episode of Stray and we are here in the- Oh, you know, it's so lucky that I actually walked up here because we- our objective is to go in here through the hole and I was very lucky that I just thought I'd start the episode by walking this way. So, we have found a, a little bit of cool, interesting- ooh, interesting things this way. Let's see it's always an objective to find the memories and we are playing stray if i didn't introduce that <laughs> i probably should have introduced that first this is this such such a good game i'm really into it right now what are we gonna get from here oh energy drink nice all right and then let's remember this memory R.I.P. Humans. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems that they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming from me, but they are actually at peace. Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry, I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. Ooh, okay. So that was an interesting memory recovered. Not like the other memories. Alright, and what is this? What is this? What is this? <laughs> I'm not sure if this is supposed to be here. I think this might be a uh, a glitch. That is hilarious. There's just like a floating person here. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is supposed to be here at all, but there we go. We have a weird floating person in the sky. Okay, that's very funny. Um, how do I turn that off? Uh, no, no, that's fine. Thank you. Okay. Right, let's talk with Momo and head on in. Remember, give the notebook to Seamus in his flat. I'm sure we'll find his weapon that his father was working on. All right, so we've got to give a notebook to Seamus. All right, so. Talk to Seamus. What are you doing in here? I told you. Get through the sewers. It's a suicide mission. Leave me be. All right, show item. Um, Doc's notebook. Is this the one? Is that the correct one? Uh, show. Sure. What's this? Wait, is this my puffers? Oh, whoa, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? Alright, so that is the end. Uh, let's... Oh. A secret lab, right under my nose. Maybe there are clues hidden somewhere around here. Alright, so we have to find a secret lab which is super interesting oh oh look at that look at that straight away the naughty kitty finds a way in i love how it jumps the kitty jumps when when we do it okay and we're having a, a poke at this one whoops okay and a poke at this one i love it it's so cute he like jumps so high in the air Okay, so, here we go. Translate. We found something on the wall. Time will tell. Interesting, okay. And Seamus and I found this thing on the wall. I've never noticed that digicode before. How did I miss it? I have no idea what the pass password could be. Hmm. Ah, okay, I see. Whoops, I see, I see. We need to find a code huh socks there's a box with socks on nothing under here that i can spy whoops uh, anything in here uh oh what's that there's something on the box there but we don't seem to be able to read that uh, nothing there, nothing there. Huh. Hmm, what could the code be? Okay, so we're still looking for the code. Interesting. I don't know, Seamus. Huh. Hmm. Maybe we have to go outside and talk to... Talk to someone else. Is this not the... Is this the code? Time will tell. Yeah, I know, but I don't know what the code is. 
Hmm. Well, let's head out and see if we can find the code. Oh, we literally can't head back out again. Okay, the code is here. The code is here somewhere. Where is this code? Huh. Can I jump onto this? No. Where else could it be? Can I jump onto that? No. Oh, only time will tell. And there's four clocks. Ah. Okay, so let's see. Two, five, one, one. Let's try that. Two, five, one, one. Okay. Two, five, one, one. <gasps> oh my goodness! Oh, that makes me so happy what we worked that out. Oh my goodness, that's satisfying. Okay, in we go! Look how cool this is! I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for the Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Wow. This is really interesting. Alright, let's translate this piece of paper on here. Robot news headlines. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. Oh dear, that's not good. So, like, literally. Oh look, and there's some Zerks here. Wow, this is so cool. He had, like, a lab experiments going on and can we jump up here and then what's this nothing in there that i can see we did that for no reason like a cat would do um uh, let's see huh i don't see anything seamus let's see find anything interesting in here no, I didn't. Hmm. There obviously is something to find. Let's see. Let's translate this. Observations. Whoops. Hang on. How do I get back up again? Observations. Cute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria of human time. Eats all kind of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to the intense light. There we go. So that's interesting. That's the kind of information we needed to know. But... Let's see. Seamus? Find anything interesting? No, we didn't, but like we just have sheet music. Whoops! We just have sheet music uh, and a drink. Let's see, anything in this box? <gasps> there is something in this box! Okay. Take a broken tracker. Nice! Seamus, Seamus! Pay attention! find anything interesting yes i did okay um boom broken tracker wait i remember that that's his tracker papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where i was maybe we can reverse it to find where he went i can't believe my papa might still be alive i've missed him so much you need a weapon for the zerks right my papa definitely took one with him we just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Ooh, thank you. He's letting us out. He's opening the door. All right. Thank you. Whoops. Thank you very much. And we still have this weird thing <laughs> floating in midair. That's fine. Ooh, we can translate this as well. Announcement. I'm looking for any sheet music to play the guitar to add some ambience. If you find any, bring them back to me. I live near the elevator. Ah, well, I have some sheet music that I could give someone. That is fun. Um, where did, um, uh, Seamus? You gotta fix that tracker. You're resourceful. Maybe you can find someone in slums to help. Alright, so we gotta run around and ask people. Huh. Alright, I think we can do that. 
So we've really got to kind of go around and... Ooh, here we go. So, bar, bar to man, super spirit laundry, grandma clothing, and Elliot programming. Now, Elliot programming seems a lot like they could do something with the tracker. So we're going to go this way. Announcement. Looking for someone capable of monitoring the sudden entrance to the safe zone. The remuneration is two pints of... Oh my gosh, Sayuba oil per day. Please contact the Guardian. Interesting. All right, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Thank you, sorry. I didn't need to press it again. Thank you. Let's see. Interesting. So we go this way? This is so cool. Hello. So if today is yesterday's tomorrow, tomorrow will be yesterday's today, right? Weird time. Time is weird. We don't age like our soft one ancestors. We are trapped here forever. Woo! That is kind of deep. Oh my goodness. Rosie. He's waving goodbye. He's waving. Okay. Wow. Right. Let's see. This way. I, I've kind of got a bit lost. What is this? Grandma's clothing. Alright. We should say hello anyway. I do love knitting. So far I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. Oh, it's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I could make you a poncho. You inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around here. <gasps> oh my gosh, I would love a poncho. <laughs> That's so cute. Wait, did we have electric cable? I swear we actually bought some electric cable. How do I go into my inventory again? No, 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 I just, where, how do I get into, oh, we did a little rub at the grandma, okay, um, I can't remember how to see my inventory, so I guess we'll leave that, and then there's two people here that don't look so great, grandma made me these clothes, pretty stylish, no? You want something? Um, here we go, show item, now I can actually see what I've got. So we didn't obviously buy the cable. Interesting. Okay. Uh, no thanks. I'm not thirsty. No, I didn't mean to show you that, but there we go. We've showed her the drink. Translate. So Elliot's programming is still this way, so we've gone the wrong way twice. So we've got to head back this way. Let's do a little run. So I think it must be down here. Okay, okay, we're back here. Okay, I know where we are now. I know where we are. So let's try this way. And I can't run anymore. What is this? Oh, are we asking to come in? It's okay, you can leave. The Guardian said it's not the Zerks. What? Oh, is that what that says? Wait, what? <laughs> I'm confused where that came from. Alright, let's see. Let's carry on this way. This is getting very dark and dingy. Ha, huh. nope, it's a dead end. Interesting. Okay. Well. Um... I don't know how we're supposed to get to the right place then. Attention, pedestrian zone. Huh. Interesting. Maybe we should show them this. Oh, it's here, is it? Translate. Elliot's programming. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. There we go. Found it. Found it. All right. Thank you. And that's cute. Are we going to do some scratchy scratchies? We are. Scratchy, scratchy, scratchies. All right, there we go. Hello, my friend. Oh, oh, he shut the door right behind us. You're here for Elliot. He's just over there. All right, he's just over there. This is not Elliot, is it? 
Thanks, sheet music. Ooh. Ooh, look at this cool plant. Oh my gosh, that's really cool. And we can translate this wall. We were programming to be slaves, but since, oh my gosh, I can't even say that number. Two, five, four, four, eight, seven, five, 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 six days. We have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find an exit of this hell. Momo. Oh, it's Momo. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Uh, tap. All right. Let's head this way for Elliot. All right. Oh, ah, look, it's a glowing tree. What the hell? That's so cool. This tree is a, is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that fri fl thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. All right, because everybody loves trees and everybody wants... Oh, I think this is a way out. I see something. Oops, hang on, I pressed stop. Aha, that's the exit. Good, 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 good. And this must be Elliot. Yes, can I help you? Show item. Let's show him this broken tracker. Oh, whoa, that's great. Tracker. I recognize this model. It's a Tohima BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Oh my goodness. He needs a blanket. <laughs> We're gonna have to go and get that poncho from, oh my goodness. We're gonna have to go all the way to the granny, get the poncho. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Go to the granny, get the poncho, get the cable for the poncho. Oh, goodness. A lot of exploring is now going to have to go into this game. All right, I'll see you guys next episode. Goodbye for now. Mm -hmm.